I'm Dan Fitzpatrick at StockMarketMentor.com on uh, Wednesday, February 15th. And I just want to go over um, skilled healthcare one more time and then we're going to get out of this. Um, I'm not going to feature this stock because it's kind of done what I was expecting it to do. Um, okay, so you get the volatility squeeze. This is the initial squeeze. The breakout is phase one. The pullback from the breakout here, a technical event hitting the 200 day moving average. That pullback is phase two. Now phase three is the move higher, which is what we got here. A move above this. Phase three is above now the 200 day moving average. It's, it's above the maximum value of the phase one rally. So now we're in phase three mode. What you're looking for here on this trade is just additional upside. This is a textbook volatility squeeze expansion trade. What you want to do is this though. Know that your stop, really I wouldn't even put the stop down here below the phase two um, uh, low here. I would put it down just a little bit. That's probably a little tight. I would put it down just below the 200 day moving average. Keep a tight stop on this thing because it's fairly thin. I mean, for crying out loud, the thing traded 375,000 shares on Wednesday. Not a lot of trading. But you can make money on a stock like this. You just need to understand the dynamics. So you keep a tight stop on this. Um, it's already a pretty nice profitable trade. Um, but you keep a stop on that. You protect your profits. You look for more upside as the stock marches along the upper Bollinger Band. Okay, members, lots to say about Apple. Um, how we're going to trade that going forward. This is going to give you a lot of opportunities, um, just not the ones that you're thinking about. So I want you to check out the strategy session. Uh, now it's a little over 30 minutes and we'll get that done. Okay, I'll see you there.